Pop the bird. Pop-ups are pretty awesome, right? They've been spreading joy to children around the world since the 1860s, depicting lifelike scenes that make us all think it's just a magic trick. But the truth is, it's all in the angles. Angles are the main reason why a pop-up card stands. It also defines how it stands. The three main angles that are used in pop-ups are the right angle, the acute angle and the obtuse angle. You call these V-folds. There are three principles when it comes to making pop-ups. First, every pop-up must have an existing crease to function. Second, every pop-up must span both sides of the creases. It must also be balanced. Third, Every pop-up will create more creases, that will create more opportunities for more pop-ups. As you can see, the 180 degree pop-up does not close properly, thus does not stand up properly. That is because there are no angles on both sides to help it stand up. Same with the 360 degree angle. But if I use an angled pop-up, it stands up. Other examples of angles in pop-ups include the parallelogram which is displayed uh, at 90 degrees the floating plane which as you can see is elevated and the pyramid which gives a three-dimensional effect these techniques are being used to design modern furniture to save space Pop-ups are great ways to bring your imagination to life using math.